What's going on, everybody? It's your homeboy, Papa Video Games here, chilling out, Max, and I'm doing my thing. Welcome to my glorious Warframe, the Warframe builds. Now, guys, we're going to be doing Harley Quinn from the Suicide Squad. Let's get into this. Now, as you see, Harley Quinn. Harley Quinn is the right-hand woman of the Joker. Now, she takes more abuse than any other character in Family Guy. Now, Harley Quinn is a psychopath. She has tremendous fighting skill, being able to even go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Batgirl and even giving Batman a run from his money. Harley actually used to be Joker's psychologist until, I guess, he warped her the same way he got warped, and boom, now she's madly in love with him. Now, they have gone on crazy rants, pissing off the Penguin and other criminal organizations. The thing is, they just want to do whatever the fuck they want. They are literally the most crazy, insane duo that the Batman ever had to deal with. Alright, now that we know about Harley Quinn, let's make a Warframe out of her. Now, if you want to get the color scheme down, you're going to have to buy the saturated color pack. Alright, now let's get into this. First off, you're going to need the Harley Quinn helmet for Mirage. You're seeing it right there. It costs about 75 plat. Literally, this right here is what makes the character. Mirage has similar mannerisms to Harley Quinn, so having a helmet and this agile animation set will be perfect because literally she copies Harley Quinn exactly how she is in the movie. Now, for the first palette, you're going to need this type of paint. Yes, you're going to need this type of paint. Now, that was actually going for her hair. Now, you're seeing that right there. She had pink, white, blue, and red on, so you want to match that. Right here, you want to go for more darker red. You see her jacket and everything. Yeah, you want to go for more dark red there. But the next one, you want to go for a blue now. Now, go for this shade of blue right here. I'm going to get rid of this. Now, you see what I'm favoring? Go for this shade. You know, the other shade is just too dark. This is the closest you're going to get to getting her full color scheme down. Now, you can actually switch the colors and get the blue on the other side, the red on the other side, and it actually divided it right where her shorts are supposed to be. So it really did match up well, not to mention the helmet. Oh, the helmet. All right, now you want to go for this type of white. The energy doesn't matter. Like, literally, the energy doesn't matter. It could be anything. You just want to get those main color sets down. Now that we talked about that, let's get into the mod section of this, my favorite part. Now, you want to have on Steel Charge. She was very proficient with melee weapons. She had a hammer. Everything that chick had, I seen her with melee only. Like, you know, she does use a gun, too, but that melee weapon is mostly. All right, now you want to have on Prime Flow. Harley Quinn had a tremendous amount of energy, more than the average person, able to keep on toe-to-toe -to -toe with Batman and Batgirl. She is extremely powerful, and she does have a lot of energy to burn. So having a Prime Flow on there would be very beneficial. Blind Rage, yes, because she does go into Blind Rage. She did that. She ran a Blind Rage to shoot at the Joker in, what was it? I, it was a Suicide Squad, the movie, actually. Well, not the live-action one, the animated one. You want to have on Narrow Mind and Continuity because she did have a tremendous amount. She was extremely healthy, fit. She had a tremendous amount of energy. And once again, she could last with Batman and Batgirl who go through tremendous training and combat every single day. She was able to last against them. So having a durability mod on there will benefit the Warframe build. All right, now you want to have the Mega Star too, or just something blunt. Like just find a blunt object and just put it in her hand. Like literally, that and a gun. I I didn't show it on here, but make sure you have some type of pistol. I personally like the Lex. You know, that was awesome. You can also use the Ascalettos or anything else. The chick was crazy. Now that we're done with this, let's see how it looks. Oh, man, I love how that turned out. Now, guys, the Suicide Squad movie looks really amazing. Got my favorite actor, Will Smith, in there. Yes, he's my favorite actor. He's, been, he's honestly, to me, the most well-recognized actor. That dude has been, like, literally in every type of big Hollywood production. Not a surprise that they brought in him for, um, you know, Deadshot. And actually, guys, we're going to be doing Deadshot today. I'm also going to be doing Killer Croc as well, so please make sure to stay tuned for that. I'll actually try to get Enchantress done, too. I'm going to try to do four videos since I didn't do any videos uh, yesterday. I'm going to try to do at least four of them so I can have Warframe builds from Suicide Squad. Something I know all of you guys will enjoy. Suicide Squad, I believe, is out now. Yeah, I believe Suicide Squad is out now. You should go check it out. Suicide Squad tells the story of Harley Quinn, Deadshot, what is it? Captain Boomerang. Killer Croc. Oh, my God. Katana. You know, I don't even think Katana was in the original Suicide Squad. Well, actually, she's actually really not in the Suicide Squad. It's more or less to guard... Um, to guard that one dude and to just go along with the mission she doesn't actually have a, she's not actually one of the suicide squad if you won the suicide squad you have that bomb in your neck see amanda waller put a bomb in their neck so telling them that they have to go do it otherwise she's gonna blow them the fuck up right so that way i don't know why they brought in katana but hey you know she was still a great addition i'll try to make a warframe out of her as well 
you know, this is going to be very, very interesting. Like, I can't wait to check it out. You know, it's going to be everybody's now really going into the whole Justice League meta stuff. Like, they got the Justice League uh, trailer out, and I was doing Warframe builds of that. I'm actually probably going to do for my fourth video, I'm probably going to do a build from the Justice League. But, guys, yeah, I'm going to be doing Deadshot and Killer Croc. I'm going to be trying to do them. I might actually instead, I might do Captain Boomerang. I might try to do him. Who knows? Put in the comments, guys. What do you think I should do first? I want to hear what you guys have to say. This is a fan-run series, so put in the comment section below. What is your favorite cartoon, anime, TV character, superhero, villain that you want me to make, that you want me to make a Warframe out of? Please let me know in the comment section below. Peace out, and talk to y'all later.